In March of 1974, the lives of two young brothers changed forever. The Godfrey family was headed to Aspen in a private plane when it crashed. Only the two boys survived. Our Kathy Walsh is here. These brothers now telling the story. That's right, and it's in a documentary that's being shown at the Denver Film Festival. For decades, the Godfreys rarely talked about the crash that killed their parents and older brother and sister. 45 years later, the film is their account of surviving three days and two nights in the frigid mountains of Colorado. 1974. So it was early March, school break. Uh, going on a, a trip to Aspen. The Godfrey family of Houston was shattered. One of the last things I remember hearing was uh, my mother saying, we're going to crash. The private plane went down in a storm on a Colorado peak southeast of Kremlin. The pilot, Godfrey parents, and two siblings died. Their baby sister wasn't on the trip. Brothers Mark and Andy, 11 and 8, were forever bonded by well, tragedy. I was uh, trapped inside some of the wreckage and unable to move. Andy followed orders given by his mother as she was dying. Uh, she told me to uh, conserve the food, take care of Mark, and don't leave the airplane. We were lost for a total of two nights and three days. 45 years later, Three Days, Two Nights, is the title of their documentary, a film produced after decades of rarely talking about the past. But part of the, uh, the message in this film is, you know, that it is not healthy to do that. So they took a camera back to the places and they relived the pain, like Mark losing his legs to severe frostbite. Uh, in the, f the blink of an eye, uh, I'm a disabled 11-year-old in a wheelchair uh, watching the world go by. The memories are emotional. The messages? Hope. I see resilience. And Mark says, maybe a mirror for others to reflect on their own path and appreciate the miracles. The brothers and their baby sister were raised by their relatives in Aspen, and there is so much more to the Godfrey story, including their incredible rescue. You have one chance left to see the documentary in Denver during the film festival, and that's Wednesday at 1.45 at the theaters at the pavilions. We so appreciate them sharing their story. I think it is so cathartic for them, yeah, and they really want to help others tell. share their stories mm -hmm. as well. Yeah, thank you, Kathy.